Hello friends, fans, haters, dwarves, dick lickers, and deviates out there watching on YouTube. I got some news, some local news from here in um, Smirdleyville. Y'all want to know what goes on here in Smirdleyville? This is the local paper, Daily Sound. This is a free paper. It doesn't cost any money. And I want to show you this news story. Something that happened late this past week. Mutilated dog found on DP campus. Officials say dog found yesterday was burned, battered, and frozen. <gasps> My God! A mutilated, partly burned dog was found on a Dos Pueblos High School sports field yesterday morning, leaving school officials, parents, and students puzzled and appalled. Barbara Kiyani, a spokesman for the Santa Barbara School District, said the dog was discovered by a gardener at 7.45 a.m. She said animal control couldn't be reached until 9 a.m. and the dog was removed shortly thereafter. It was dead and it had been wrapped in a blanket or towel, Kayana said. Someone had tried to set it on fire! <gasps> she said school principal Mark said the dog appeared to have abrasions that indicated the dog had been beaten by some object. She also said the dog was reported to be partially frozen. Kayani said she did not know the age of the dog or the breed. Kathy Gregory, whose 15-year-old daughter attends the school, said her daughter told her that someone spray-painted Senior's Rule and other comments around the campus. Kayana could not confirm if the campus had been vandalized with spray paint. The Dos Pueblos High School football team played last night on St. Bonaventure, and it is unknown if the game could have motivated the slain dog. Gregory said the dog carcass is extremely troubling. It disturbs me because of the high school where these kids could have done something like that. I don't think there's any regard for what a young person might see and how it might affect them. It was done at a public school, for God's sakes, and that what bothers me. Well, well, shit. That, that didn't happen too far away from here. You mean to tell me that there's, there's some kind of a, some kind of a sicko running around loose doing stuff like that in my community? Not funny. They haven't caught whoever did it. Look at the date on the newspaper. Saturday, October 27th, 2007. It's Halloween. Come on, people. It's only a joke. Yeah, it happened, but it's the oldest schoolboy prank in the world. Kids have been doing this every year since my great-great-great-grandma was a little girl. <laughs> what happens is your dog dies or you find a dead dog somewhere. You put it in a freezer and wait until Halloween. Then you bring it out and you wrap it up in a blanket and pour lighter fluid on it. Drag it to your high school where you go and set it on fire in the middle of the night and run away laughing. Tomorrow morning they come, they find it. Ha! Ah, Halloween prank! Ah, lighten up, people. Come on, it's Halloween. Now, Biggie! Now, Biggie!